My father's childhood dream was to be a lawyer and to be Secretary of Justice. Safe to say he exceeded his childhood dreams. My father attributed his success to his upbringing and to his education. Lagi po niyang pinagyayabang sa akin na kahit kailan hindi po siya nagbayad ng tuition fee. Scholar daw po siya from UP to Baler Central School, or Central Baler Central School to UP, UP College of Law, and the University of Michigan. Kulang po ang oras ngayong araw para pag-usapan ang lahat ng kanyang nailathalang batas, ikwento ang lahat ng kwento, at banggitin ang lahat ng parangal na natanggap ng aking ama. History and the history writers will take care of that. What we request is that all of you here remember our father fondly as a reformer, as an institution builder, as a builder of dreams, an enabler of dreams, an enabler of people. My father was human like everyone else, and if he hurt any of you here, humihingi po kami ng paumanhin. As I said, he had a quick temper. It was never personal with him. It was always born out of a strong will to get things done. Very impatient po ang aking father. A week before he passed, he took a trip to Hong Kong with our youngest child, Javier. And his plan was just for him, 83-year-old man, and a seven-year-old grandson to travel to Hong Kong together. And my foolish secretary booked it, the two of them. And uh, <laughs> imagine if something happened to him. Sino mag-aalaga sa kanya? Yung aking apo. Ay, yung kanyang apo. But uh, no, uh, that, I think he was in a good place when he passed because as Senator Frank said, he spent his last night or his last day on earth with his co-workers, his partners, and his dearest friends. And some of you are here today.